Member for Richmond South Centre. I'll be this time. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. And I rise for today to your we'll speak about opportunity about rural social work today. I do want to acknowledge I'm speaking from a mus uh, my writing, Richmond South Centre. It's from a Musqueam Coast Salish territory. I thank them for allowing us to live, work, and play in an unceded and traditional territory. Today, I would like to talk about a World Social Work Day, which is actually March 16, 2021. I'm going to be borrowing a term, and if I do mispronounce it, I do ask for everyone's apologies. The term is called Ubuntu. Ubuntu means I am because we are. I think one of the things we often understand that due to the COVID-19 pandemic, it has altered our normality for society today. British Columbians, like many other citizens around the world, cannot be coming together physically due to the pandemic. Also, we are not able to hug, hold hands, or converse in close proximity. British Columbians innovatively and resiliently found ways to stay connected. Despite the fact that we are a year in the pandemic, the majority of British Columbians are still going strong in our compliance to Dr. Bonnie Henry's order. I am for that, thank them, and thank everybody. And we are also stronger because we're stronger together. However, the pandemic also amplified the many social service challenges that we are facing today. Addictions, domestic violence, mental health, youth at risk, racism, income inequality, and much more. Social workers are often the ones who have to be in the front line to be taking on the first services to serve the British Columbians, and the pandemic has amplified the challenge that we're facing today. From finding a shelter spot for domestic violence escapees to actually helping individuals with addiction to find proper counseling services, we thank them for all the social workers to take the time out of, out of the awkward hours, days, and being overworked to serve British Columbia. Thank you.